with no truce in sight. Ramadan began in Gaza with airstrikes over the southern city of Rafa. And the now all too familiar search for survivors after another building was reduced to rubble. Just one hour before the dawn prayer on the first day of Ramadan, in the home of civilians, normal people minding their own business, sleeping in their own homes, became martyrs. Amid widespread hunger and with 80% of the population displaced, there was little excitement to be found ahead of the normally joyous month of dawn to dusk fasting. I'm shopping for Ramadan. The atmosphere is sad. It makes you want to cry. There are no signs of joy. Everyone looks sad. Prices are soaring. Every family has lost someone, and many have lost their homes too. Our hearts are bleeding. There is no Ramadan atmosphere. Despite a diplomatic push from the US, Qatar and Egypt, talks in Cairo did not secure a ceasefire in time for the start of the Islamic holy month which would have included the release of Israeli hostages and Palestinian prisoners and the entry of a large amount of humanitarian aid. Israel has previously warned of a military offensive into Rafah if the hostages being held by Hamas weren't home by Ramadan.